Hello, uh, YouTube user called Todd was wanting to know how to use Snorion to control the Blofeld. He was having some trouble, there was uh, notes triggering twice, um, duplicating on MIDI channels, things like that, so that you got two sounds playing together. He didn't want that, he wanted to be able to use certain MIDI channels on the Snorion to control just the Blofeld, and then other ones just the Snorion without having any sound playing from the Blofeld at the same time. Um, I found the easiest and cheapest way to do this was to create silent patches on both the Blowfield and the Tenorion. You can use MIDI filters for things like these, but they're costly, hard to set up, and can be very, very fiddly. If you're using a computer, you can use the ones built into MIDI AUX, uh, Cubase, all the big sequencers have one built in. But if you just want to use a hardware sequencer with a sound module built into it to control a synth, then the easiest way is a silent patch. On the blow filter, I created it using just to create a regular preset, but I set all the oscillators to off, the filters to off, ring modulation to off, um, noise to off, so that it's absolutely silent even when a note is received. On the Tenorion, I had to use the sampling feature. I loaded up 16 slots of silence, created a preset, and loaded that into user 2. So at the moment, you're hearing a chord sequence. It's a nice road sound. That's being played by the blow filter. As far as the Tenorion is concerned, it's playing its silent patch. But the mini note is coming out, going into the blow field, triggering the road sound. Um, everything I have triggering off the blow field is here. I have a sequence, some chords, and the road sound. Then everything I want the Tenorion to play, I have there. Some drums, pops, leaps, etc. A nice straw feature, really like that. So just to demonstrate what Todd didn't want, um, I've created this little sequence here. Um, at the moment, both silent patches are playing it. So imagine I just want the Tenorion to play it. So so this is that violin sample, and I hadn't set the silence on the blow for it. Selecting the silence, you just get the violin sample, or by selecting the silence on the story, you get just the violin sample. On the blowfield. So that's what he, he didn't want, was two sounds playing together at the same time, and this was my solution for it. Anything else I can help anyone with, um, let me know. Just leave a message on here. If I can help you, I will. I'm more than happy to. And in the meantime, take care and you know, have a good Christmas.